Hi guys! So today I'm going to make a video about Killstar items that I've purchased in the past. I am a Killstar addict. I love their clothes. Um, as you can see, I'm wearing a shirt from them right now. Um, I've been buying Killstar four years. I would want to say the first time I ordered from Killstar was probably seven years ago. Um, and I usually place about three orders a year, ranging from $200 to $600. Um, I did the math the other day and I spend, I've spent well over $5,000 on Killstar items over the past seven years. So that's just to tell you how much I like them. Um, I've been reselling some of the items um, that over the years I've grown out of or um, I just don't like anymore. But today I'm going to make a quick video about some recent release stuff. Um, I videotaped everything separately, so forgive me for the lighting that's going to change. So here are the Forsaken jeans. Um, this is a size small. They're actually pretty comfortable, but as you can see, there's still a little bit of room. They're pretty stretchy. Um, I'm 5'5", five five, so they do have some room at the bottom, as you can see. So if you're a little taller than me, you should be fine. You can wear it with heels as well. As you can see, there is some stretch there, which I don't personally mind. I probably could have been able to go with an extra small. Here we have the Pandora shirt dress. I am in love with this shirt. Um, I wear it as a shirt. Um, I wear it to work. It's really comfortable. I am a size C. As you can see, um, it does. it is a little tight at the boob area. In regards to the pants, these are the Severin pants. They just came out. Some people had some uh, complaints about them and the paint fading. I haven't had this issue. They're quite comfortable. I really, really, really like them. Even in the cold weather, they keep you warm. Now we have the Graveland skater dress. Um, I've read a lot of comments about how this dress feels like a nightgown. Um, to some extent, I kind of agree. As you can see, the detail is still kind of fine. Um, the velvet is a little too shiny, perhaps. But to be honest with you, overall, it's pretty comfortable and I still quite like it. Here now we have the Sacred Six Maxi Skirt. I am in love with that skirt. It's very staticky, so it's kind of stuck to my body right now. But to be honest with you, it is amazing. It's very flowy, very light. It looks awesome. Um... As you can see, it's stuck to my knee, but um, other than that, it's great. And here is a picture of a welcome doormat. I absolutely love bats, so this was an amazing addition to my home. Um, I just keep it in an area where there's not a lot of traffic, to be honest with you. So the latest Killstar haul. Um, I'm lying because I actually did order some crayons because I like random stuff. Um... So I have some crayons. It's a set of three crayons, Killstar, and they're all black. Um, I love black stuff. Anything black that I can find, I will buy it. Black toothbrush, black toothpaste, everything. Um, so with that, I ordered the little coffin case, um, um, sharpener, sorry, and also the little bat eraser that is scented. It doesn't smell very good. I mean, I don't know why they would make a scented eraser to start with, but I mean, cool. Um, I'm obsessed with bats, so this is another little addition to my little bat collection. I will never use it, but it's still cool. Um, regards to the video, I will probably make more. I will keep them fairly short because I don't want to over talk. If you have any questions, you can certainly ask in the comments. Um, but for now, I mean, I'll just keep it very simple.